is an alpaca 1700 road trip adventure rack set up to carry bikes. To convert it to a ski and snowboard rack, spacers are removed from the strap and rings are added, allowing items to be carried much closer together. For the load I intend to carry, five rings are added to each cinch strap. To put the cam buckle back on the strap, I press the buckle and feed the strap through from the bottom and the rack is ready to load. I will load two snowboards, they can be loaded bottom to bottom. I then run the strap over the snowboard, a loose ring over the end of this pin, and against the snowboards. Do the same thing for the other side. I am loading diverse items to help demonstrate what the rack can carry. This next item is a pair of cross country skis. Run the strap over the top, slide the ring against the skis and pull the strap tight. Repeat for the other side. I will mix it up a little by adding some ski poles. Run the strap over the top of the poles, slide the loose ring against the poles and pull the strap tight. Bunch the poles together on the pin, run the strap over the top of the poles, slide the loose ring against the poles and pull the strap tight. Sometimes in the winter the roads can get bad. This is a great idea for long trips. Shrink wrap the skis or carry them in protective bags. Load them onto the rack, run the strap over the top of the skis, a loose ring against the skis and pull the strap tight. Do the same thing for the other pin. This last item is a pair of powder skis. Run the strap over the top of the skis, the last loose ring against the skis and pull the strap tight. The strap will go back to the other end of the pin. Repeat this process for the other pin. The process is always the same but in this situation there are no pedals or handlebars to deal with making it easier. Hook the ring on the end of the strap over the end of the pin and pull the strap tight. Give the top strap a pull and re-tighten. Notice how I tighten this last strap. I hook the ring over the end of the pin and pull the strap tight. Then I grab this top long strap and give it a pull to take all the slack out of the strap and re-tighten. To unload the rack, the process is reversed. Loosen the strap. Loosen the other strap, slide the ring off and start removing items. This is a very quick and simple process. Slide the ring off the end of the pin, take the strap off the item, go to the other pin, slide the ring off the end of the pin, then take the strap off the item and remove the item.
To secure these long straps to the empty rack, slide the rings onto the pin, run the strap around the other pin, hook the ring on the end of the strap, back over its original pin, and pull the strap tight. Take the other strap, slide the rings onto a pin, run the strap around the other pin, hook the ring on the end of the strap, back over its original pin, and pull the strap tight. The straps are secure to the rack.